Hey guys, it's Saturday 8610. I have a box opening for you guys. Order of Chaos OCG, so that means this is Japanese, of course. We'll be getting our English one, I believe it's January, if I'm not mistaken on that. I think it's January 24th. Correct me if I'm wrong on that. I think that's the right date. Anyway, though, I got this from Ideal808.com. Link in the description to their website. Awesome website. Uh, they're the place I get all the Japanese cards, and uh, they have great prices on that. So yeah, be sure to check them out. And, uh, yeah, let me get a knife out and cut through this shrink wrap on it. So, hopefully I don't cut myself. Don't want to bleed all over the cards. Well, come on. I can't cut through that. Helps if you use the right side of the knife. The actual sharp side of it. <laughs> Good grief. So, yeah, I also got scissors just in case I can't open the packs because sometimes that happens. Uh, Japanese packs are a lot harder to open, in my opinion. I know a lot of people say sometimes it's easier for them, but... I have a harder time opening them. Let's see. I'm about to rip it. There we go. I want to try to stand it up. There we go. And all the different packs. Alright, also I'm going to give a shout out to Chicken Wings, I believe is how you say his username. He's been doing a lot of interviews and stuff. And, uh,. Yeah, he's even interviewed me in one of his videos. He's looking for a lot of other people to interview. It doesn't matter how popular you are. Uh, he will still interview you. So uh, be sure to contact him, subscribe to him, and uh, maybe you can get an interview. All right? Sorry, my hands are a little shaky. See, I don't know the names of everything, but I'm mainly going to go over the hollows and stuff at the end of the video, of course. So yeah, we'll have like a review, whether it be a separate video or after this. Yeah, we got a rare already. It's hard to remember all their names. Uh, I think I've been getting from this side, so let's put this side. I know there are like, supposed to be easier ways to open these than the scissors, but I'm afraid it would take me too long. And I don't want you guys to see me fight with a bunch of packs. <laughs> right, we got that uh, ZW, it's like that unicorn, Zale Unicorn, I think is its name. Pretty awesome looking. I believe it works with uh, the new Utopia, which is the guy on the front. Let's see. Get a few of the packs out like this. It might be easier. Seems like they use a lot more plastic on their packs. Like their packs are a lot taller than ours. Of course, they actually have like a spot where they have like a hole in the top of the pack so they can hang them up, I guess, on display. Ninja archetype is in this, which is pretty neat. Another rare. Let's see, ninjas, some photons, uh, wind ups. I'm trying to think of other things that are supposed to be in here. Uh, Insectors, I believe is how you pronounce Insector. That's the other new art type. So yeah, that's pretty awesome. There's a wind-up. It's like honeybee or something. There's a new Elvazor, or Elva, or whatever. It's one or the other. Those are pretty neat. I've been tempted to run those, but the Xyz are kind of expensive for them. I already have one of the Xyz, but I think I'm just going to trade it instead. Pretty cool looking cards. Another rare. Come on, I want to see some hollows. I don't remember what exactly you're supposed to get on their boxes. I don't know if it's like a certain number of hollows. Like with us, it's like so many supers and we get like guaranteed a secret supposedly and like two ultras and all that. I don't know how theirs go. And I've opened up more than one of these boxes and I still don't know that. There we go. There's one of the new uh, Elvazors. Or Elva Kaiser, I guess, really, because he's the dragon. Uh, let's see, he is uh, rank 6. So, yeah, that's pretty awesome. Uh, let's see, I can't think of his name right now. We'll get back to him, like I said, though. Put the hollows on a different side. Let's see. Wind up. I think it's wind up mouse. I don't know. You would think it would be because he's a mouse or rat or something. See, I believe this is for the new uh, gustos. You can kind of see, like, when the gusto guys is like up there on like the altar, like, a little green like spot. I think it's supposed to help them. Curry Bolt, 
Yeah, that's an awesome card, actually. A rare. I don't remember that one. I feel bad for not remembering some of these. Putting Curry Bolt to the side because he's awesome. I actually have a video over it, so be sure to check that out. Let's see what else we're gonna get. Let's see, making sure I don't cut into any cards. I think I almost screwed up there. I would feel terrible if I cut into a card. Oh, there we go. Utopia Ray. That's the main card, of course. He's really awesome looking. Dang. <laughs> I don't think it matters if you see the text, because I can't read it, but maybe someone out there can. I don't know. I've been tempted to learn Japanese, or at least how to read Japanese, since I like opening these packs. Another rare. See, two XCs so far, though. Not bad. Hadn't really noticed many ninjas. I think they're supposed to be common, if I'm not mistaken. Gaga -ga -ga Girl. That's pretty awesome. And, uh, yeah, I don't remember that rare one. I, I, I do, but I don't. I can't remember what it's called. But Gaga -ga Girl, that's awesome. Yeah, I've been, I was actually wanting this one. Because it's pretty neat. I want it in the English version as well. I think it's going to be... My guess is that it might be a rare in the English version, but who knows. Also, since I have these cards, I can do card reviews for you guys a little easier. I'll do them in front of the camera and show the Japanese card, at least. So hopefully you guys will be looking forward to that. There's a ninja. Another rare one. I think everything's going to be for trade, too. I don't know about the hollows yet. I'm kind of tempted to keep the, the Gaga Girl and uh, the Utopia Ray, but we will see. I think that's that ninja art transformation or whatever. That's actually going to be a pretty awesome card for the ninjas. It like makes it where they can turn into a dinosaur dragon or winged beast, I believe is the other one. It's, it's pretty neat. I know First Kage 6 is like just posted a review over that, so be sure to check that out as well. See, so here's like the earth ninja. Curry Bolt again, that's awesome. In Sector, there's one of them. The ninjas, I don't know if it's just me, but they kind of remind me of Power Rangers. See, and here's the other side of the box. I believe there's a pretty good amount of packs in these as well. More than what we get in English. But they also have less cards in each pack. If you've noticed. So yeah, I'll probably have another video after this one, and we'll review all the hollows and stuff, or, you know, significant cards, you know, if, even if it's rare and stuff, and uh, I will talk about their effects and stuff, and I also have separate videos for certain ones, too. I think that's another Photon. That way people that just want to see a pack opening can see the pack opening, and then people that want another review can see the review. I'm actually starting to catch up on watching Yu Gi Oh! Zell as well. So, I actually saw Curry Bolt being played the other day. So, that was pretty awesome. Let's see, another Insector. I'd like to get one of the new numbers. You know, besides Utopia Ray, of course. Or I'd like to get a Ghost Rare. I don't know if you do since I already got an. Uh, ultimate. There's, go, that goes with the Illustors, or, I believe. Another ninja. Another Illusor. It has, I think that's like Gaga Bolt, or it's one of those, because it has both of them in it, Gaga Magician and Gaga Girl, so yeah, that's pretty awesome artwork. Wish they had better names, though. 
Kyra Gaj sounds kind of weird to me. I kind of like the new Dark Magician, Dark Magician Girl, for people that haven't noticed. That's so pretty neat. See, another wind-up mouse, I assume. That's too much mouse. Another ninja. Let's see, here's, I believe, number 96, Black Mist, I believe is his name. He's pretty awesome. I think he requires three level two monsters. That's pretty cool. I think he's the highest number so far. I think, I'm not sure on that. I need to look through more of the number cards. Like I said, I've been watching a whole lot of the anime, although I'm trying to catch up these days. Hopefully you guys can't hear all the background noise right now. See another, like, Gusto. Let's see. Another rare. Come on, give me a few more XCs. I like the OCG ones. They look really cool. Another ninja. I'm actually tempted to run ninjas. See, here's a... Oh, there's that uh, Dark Blade Knight or something like that. Pretty awesome. We're going to have a review over him sometime soon. And I don't remember the name of this one, but we will get back to it. Don't worry. For some reason, I'm putting it in rare panel. There we go. bad for not remembering all the cards names, so it's hard to remember all. Just remember the ones I'm mainly after. Alright. Another, uh, oh, what are they called? Insectors? Pretty neat looking one. We'll get back to them as well. Like I said, all the hollows, we'll get back to them. We'll talk about their effects and everything. I'm sorry I don't remember their exact names. Let's see, last pack, what will we get? What will we get? Will it be a hollow? Or will it be a rare? We'll see. The suspense is killing y'all. <laughs> and, oh, uh, I think it's a photon guy. I'm not sure. Yeah, though, let's go over the hollows. I'm sure you guys saw all the comments and everything. And the rares, so we'll just go over the hollows, and hopefully I won't hit the camera again. <laughs> anyway, let's see. Got all these guys. Evasaur, and Insector. I believe that works with the Insectors as well. Black Mist, Gaga -ga Girl, and uh, Utopia Ray. Or, I guess, Hope Ray for OCG. So yeah, though, pretty awesome. Like I said, I will have a separate video here in a sec over all these. We will go over their effects, everything, so be sure to check out that. It will be either in the description or it will be as a video response as well if you want to check that out. And yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. Remember, I got this from Ideal808.com, awesome place. And please tell me how the camera is doing. It should be pretty good. Like I like how it focuses in and gets all the detail of the cards. So yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. And I'm um, sorry I didn't remember the names of everything. Like I said, I'm only remembering like certain ones I'm after, like like the number of monsters and stuff I really want to get from the English packs. And like I said, I believe we'll be getting these in English in January. I think it's 24th, if I'm not mistaken on that. So yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, and see you guys later. Bye. Hey guys, hopefully you enjoyed my latest video. For more great videos over Yu-Gi-Oh!, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Also, be sure to check out the description to see my Facebook account, and also see my website, cyrus.com, for the latest Yu-Gi-Oh! news. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.